It's unconstitutional for the president to continue to include in the appropriation bill the remuneration, salaries and allowances of judges. This is the view of a former president of the Nigerian Bar Association and senior advocate of Nigeria, Mr. Olisa Agbakuba. In an interview with our judiciary correspondent, Shola Shoele, Mr. Agbakuba says the time has come to demand the constitutional first charge funding of the judiciary and some other agencies of government in accordance with the provisions of Section 81, Subsection 2 and Section 84, Subsections 1 to 7 of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. You'd be shocked to know that the police is there. INEC, the National Assembly. Now, if my case will lead to freeing up government agencies from executive control, and if those agencies are freed up and they begin to act independent of the executive, for instance, the IG of police will say, heck, the president doesn't pay me. I'm paid under the charge, so I'm free. Accountant General, Auditor General. So you can, you can begin to see that this process has the potential to institutionalize. Set a precedent absolutely, for all absolutely, to absolutely. And then all those people, all those bodies become independent. That's the key. And they are not subservient. That's the key. The because the only reason why the executive is able to be unaccountable is that they pay everybody. And money is, the, money is it. Yeah.